What is up, Paradox? In this video, be customizing the brand new Declasse Yosemite Rancher, which is a Benny's vehicle. So basically, you get the regular Yosemite, you drive it into Benny's, and you turn it into something like that, which is pretty crazy. So the regular Yosemite is pretty much like a street truck, and then this one, the Rancher, is more like an off-road truck. So something a little different, pretty cool. I've heard it has a lot of customization, some crazy stuff. So I guess we'll see. Let's go ahead and take it into Benny's. And for those of you who don't know, the Yosemite is primarily based on the second generation Chevy C10 pickup truck. A lot of people know that already, so let's go ahead and bring it in. What you looking for? Never thought I'd be bringing Yosemite into Benny's. Alrighty. Upgraded Benny's, $490,000 plus the other price, so you're going to be over a million dollars. Um, yeah. Okay. Whoa, <laughs> now that is cool. Reminds me kind of like a Bronco a little bit, even though it's kind of like an insult to the Chevy people. Okay, fine. It reminds me kind of like a Blazer. I think that's a little better. <laughs> that's awesome. Okay, armor, brakes, brakes, bull bars, single loop, secondary loop, primary, triple... Wow. Oh, I like that. The wide frame bar. The lights. That's sick. All right, let's do the wide frame bar with the lights. We do secondary. Definitely going to do an off road build because we're <laughs> pretty much forced to. So, front bumper, front bumper delete. No bumper and chin. Bumper and chin. Smooth, smooth bumper. That one's nice. The Mark II balance and fogs. Chrome sweep. Oh, off road. Yes, that's nice. That is sick. Off road stinger. Whoa, off road shield. Now we're talking. I like that with the big winch. That's sick. That's what you was Let's do that. For. Rear bumpers. Rear bumper delete. Chrome, chrome. Off road and off road. Stinger. Stinger for sure. Pretty. Chassis, skid plate. Oh, okay. Different skid plates. Jeez, that's crazy. Rhino skid plate. I'm going to do it without the skid plate. I feel like. This is GTA, it's not real life. <laughs> so the less you have there, the better it is for a hitbox and stuff like that. Who knows if that goes through it or if that catches on stuff. I'm not sure. I don't want to experiment with it, so I'll just leave it like that. Secondary light bar. I like the LED light bar. I wonder if that even works. I doubt it, but I guess we'll see. Hood accessories. Chrome hood catch. Cable. Okay. Hood deflector, trail hood, okay, chrome hood with vents, I like that, do we do the vents, I think just two vents is fine, that's a little excessive isn't it, I think without the vents, without any of that stuff, roll cage, oh okay, the fuel cell, Four point I like that. Wow, that is sick. Roll cage with a tire mount. I like that. That is nice. Looks kind of like a trophy truck or something. That's sick. Engine block. V8 painted covers. Chrome painted ribbed covers. Chrome. Okay, so we'll do painted rib covers. Now that's an engine. Air filters, chrome, twin titanium ram, swept, and then angled. Hmm. I guess the twin air filters, I think, will do that. Engine's in. Engine tune, yep. Exhaust. Okay, that's stock. You got tuner, chrome. Side exit exhaust. OK. 
Okay. I like the chrome exhaust. That's a nice one. Chrome. Fenders. We got street flares. Arc flares. Raptor flares. Those are sick. I like that. Kind of like a boxed off look. A squared off look, I should say. Let's do the raptor arches. Grow. Primary, secondary. The chrome, secondary, cross grill. Different types of grills here. Dual. Painted. I think, um. Like secondary grill. Hood. Didn't we already? Oh, we had hood accessories. So now this is the actual hood options. Okay. Rusty carbon. Okay. Um. <laughs> okay. That's that's funny. What is this one? Wiper hood. No, it's got like a. What's the difference between the wiper hood and the stock? I can't really tell. Wiper hood. Oh, wait. I was thinking windshield wipers. I guess I'm wrong. I I don't. I don't even know. Let's continue. Single intake, stinger hood, power bulge. Wow, this color is really, really bright. Let's put silver, because that's that's hurting the eyes. <laughs> okay. Back to hoods. Bug catchers. This one I couldn't figure out what it was. Oh. Oh, the middle part is higher up. Oh. Okay. I like that one. That's nice. Okay, let's continue. Got stinger hood. Power bulge. Reminds me kind of like a Jeep. That's like very similar to a Jeep. Stinger vented. That one's pretty cool. The one with a vent is pretty nice. Power. Let's do the power bulge, I guess. All dressed up. Okay, interior. Oh, I'm gonna put a truck horn on this just for fun. Yes. Interior ornaments. Oh gosh, you can do all the Benny ornaments and stuff. I'm not gonna mess with any of that. Dials. Oh wow, okay. Reusing a lot of the Benny stuff here. These are nice. There's nothing really wrong with the stock gauges, <laughs> but um. I guess we'll do these. Seats. Rustic carpet <laughs> over bench. Two-tone, old school. Wow. Shifter bench. Gator skin. Snake skin. World War II combat seat. Basic bucket seat. Lightweight race seat. Aluminum bucket. I think the basic buckets might work. Again, this is like more of an off-road build, so we're not meant to have a comfy, beautiful bench seat. <laughs> Nothing like that. The basic bucket okay, seat. Happy. Steering wheels. Yeah, the stock one is not that great. What we got here. I think I might go with the resto mod. This one's nice too. Okay, let's go resto mod. Column shifters. Where does this thing have the shifter then? It's not, okay, well, I guess we'll just throw one on there. These are all general Benny stuff. I want eight ball on there, whatever. There Doors. What is that? Whoa. Half door, quarter window. Okay. Well, I like my doors, so <laughs> I'm not, I'm not taking off my doors. And this removes that part there. Okay, that's weird. 
I'm gonna leave that stock. Light color. I'm not gonna mess with that. Roll cage. Okay. This has a lot of options. Web roll cage, padded. Which one should we do? A basic roll cage is fine. Got lights. Leave that stock. Livery. All right, liveries. Yes. Skid stripes. Sunset stripes. Sprint. Jackal racing camel. That's pretty sick. A camel combined with. That's that's nice. Reptile camo. Shark teeth. I love that. Sticky camo. Slick camo. Track master. Autocross destroyer. And I think these are just the normal Yosemite liveries here. Yep. Oh wow, this is the Drift Yosemite livery. Interesting. I think the one with the shark. I like that one's pretty cool. Shark teeth camo. I like that one. Something different. It's awesome. Go crazy with this one. Alright, respray. Okay, so it's that part behind it. Hmm. You might have to go for like a dark green or something like that. Maybe like a matte color. Matte forest green. Maybe just matte black. How does matte black look? Matte black is pretty sick too. Matte gray. I'm gonna do matte gray. Foliage green. Let's do the foliage green. Okay, secondary. Oh, okay. Yeah, those are all the parts I put. Let's leave that. Let's do that matte black. Trim color is your interior color. Hmm. Should I change this? I mean, I like it in black. It's just too much, too much color in here. Kremlin would go. Wow, look at that. It was right there at the very bottom. Really small. That's interesting. Roof. Okay, bed cap. Wow, off road soft top. That's crazy looking. <laughs> That's insane. No roof. Oh, no roof for the. Okay. That's pretty sick. Should we do no roof? That's awesome looking. Something different. That's that's sick. Let's do that. Snorkels. Trail snorkel. I've been told the snorkel doesn't work, but just for the that's look. Sidestep. Which one? This one's pretty subtle. The rhino sidesteps. Let's do that. Sun strips. Class. Okay. Suspension. I'm not going to lower that. Transmission. Truck bed. Primary and then second. Definitely secondary. Trunk door. Well, this just keeps going on and on. Stock. We've got the chrome badging. Cargo web net. That's insane. Hmm. I think the chrome badging is kind of nice because it, it's kind of like a nod to what it was or, you know, what it still is, kind of. And it matches our chrome tips, too. I'm going to do the chrome badging. Turbo. Wheels. Supposedly there's new off-road wheels. That should be interesting. Pick something new. Here we go. Retro Steely. Heavy Duty Steely. That's probably a probably I'll do that. Concave. That's nice too. Lightweight. Steely. Oh wow, these are nice. Look at that. That's sick. I like the mountain man. These are nice too, the Concave Rally Master. I like that. Alright, let's do the Concave Rally Master. Those are sick and black. Wow. That is nice. Very nice. 
Higher design. <laughs> that looks awesome. Let's do that. What are we missing? Windows. We're kind of out of windows, but we still got that. So do light smoke, I guess. Um, we're missing one little thing. No, I was messing around with the doors. Here we go. This. Ah, there. That's why you have that. Okay, that makes more sense now. Half door with quarter window. Okay. That looks a lot better. All right, there we are. Pretty much done. A crazy off-road looking build. Let's see how this thing drives. Oh boy. Isn't the off-roads class, thankfully? Sometimes Rockstar gives us a vehicle and they put it in the wrong class. Wow, this thing is very, very floaty, the suspension. Which makes sense as an off-road vehicle. That's, that's kind of funny the way it drives. Kind of sways. <laughs> this thing, this is awesome. I like this. Very smooth. Definitely gotta go off-roading with this. Mountains, let's see how it does. Super smooth. Pulling up very nicely. No problem at all. Look at that. This thing's got a lot of power. Rockets up these mountains, that's insane. That is cool. And the lights, light bar works, and the optional lights work, so... Thankfully, even the bumper lights work, look at that. So, every light option you can put on this thing actually works, thankfully. So, I'm glad Rockstar did that this time around. This thing is awesome. Look at that. Jeez, man, the torque this has is incredible. Very well done. All right, let's see what opens up here. Oh, perfect. We saw that at Benny's. <laughs> That's sick. That is really cool. I like that a lot. Not a not a classic Bronco, but kind of like a Blazer esque build, sorta. Um, even though it says lifted C10, but you get the point. I like it. It's pretty cool. For the money, I don't know. I think I think it might be a good off-road vehicle. I mean, as you guys like do my off-road capability testing, um, so we'll be doing this later on. Or not right away. Give, give me some time to get to it, because those videos take me a while to make. Um, but I'll definitely be getting to it in the future, off-road test for this. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.